Good afternoon, everyone. This is Christy of Van Allen Company. Today is Thursday, September 10th. I'm just going to go over the markets for the day. Uh, you know, you had really quiet trade majority of the day. You were able to muster higher trade for uh, most of the grains with corn up five at 374, beans up two and a half at 874 and a half, and then wheat up six and a quarter at 478 and a half. Uh, really what you had is you had both trades starting lower, working its way slightly higher through the day. Um, trading both sides as positions probably square up in front of tomorrow's crop report. Um, you're going to have a lot of information out of tomorrow's crop report. You haven't had much lately. Uh, you do have people calling for both sides of trade, higher and lower carryouts. So it should be an interesting trade and it's really going to dictate how grains go um, for the rest of the afternoon and setting the tone for the next week. Um, really besides that, export sales also come out tomorrow. They're a pushback because of holiday trade on Monday. And so you're going to get a little bit more information there too. You did have support of outside markets, so that could have lent a little bit of supply. But overall, you know, is is pretty quiet and closed slightly higher. Um, really trading the exact opposite were meats. They started slightly higher and ended up trading lower throughout the day. Lives down 50 cents. Feeders also down 50. Hogs down 37 and a half. It looks like asking prices are 146 live in the south. No bids. Uh, you did have trade of 140 in Iowa. That's really steady with last week's trade. Uh, you do think you're going to see some trade in the south tomorrow. Um, choice cutout was down 26 cents at noon. Select was down 34. Cash hogs were steady. Uh, it continues to have more slaughter um, every week coming in. Besides that, your big thing is going to be uh, coming in here and seeing tomorrow's crop report, and you'll see that trade really dictate from there. I do have to close with a disclaimer. Trading in futures and options involves risk loss and may not be suitable for all producers. Have a great day.